Hi guys, in the previous video we were talking about uh, who Theodore Mommsen is. Okay, essentially this great, great historian of Rome. And uh, I'm sure a lot of you have heard of uh, Edward Gibbon. If you, you know, got into Roman history, uh, you probably know about, you know, Edward Gibbon and about his uh, big book about uh, the decline of the Roman Empire. And uh, Monzen is kind of a rival, okay? So when we talk about, you know, the greatest, uh, you know, book about the Roman Empire written in the 19th century, um, you know, most people would say it's, you know, Edward Gibbon's, uh, you know, monumental text. But I think Monzen's uh, five-volume History of Rome is just as good. All right, so Momsen's History of Rome was initially published in three volumes. And, uh, you know, you kind of might be uh, confused, you know, if you because you see it's five books here, but, you know, they were published as three. So essentially, you know, these uh, three books, you know, the first three were published as one and then it was volume four and then volume five. OK, so it's a pretty humongous text. Um and a lot of you might be discouraged by this um, size of it. However, it's really, really terrific. Okay, if you wanna, uh, you know, really get into Roman history, really get deep into it, um, you cannot avoid uh, Momsen's uh, masterpiece, History of Rome. All right, so um, it's uh, a little bit hard at first, you know, getting into him, it's, you know, a little bit slow. His language is dense, uh, you know, he's extremely erudite, you know, he has all these references and citations, um, but, you know, his language is really, really beautiful and it really helps you, you know, kind of uh, get through it uh, to some extent. So. Um, even though it's big, even though it's tough, you really should read Theodore Momsen's History of Rome, okay? Um, and uh, the volumes uh, essentially talk about, you know, Rome from the earliest times until Julius Caesar, okay? So, you know, it talks about the Roman Republic, okay? It's history of the Roman Republic. And by the way, if you're, you know, clueless about, you know, if you're just kind of a beginner to history, uh, you know, you might hear these words, uh, Roman Republic and Roman Empire. Like, what is the difference? Well, essentially, the Roman Republic ends with Julius Caesar, okay? And, you know, um, Momsen's history of Rome is essentially history of the Roman Republic, okay? Beginning with Romulus all the way to Caesar. You know, he talks about, uh, you know, how the Senate was formed uh, and, you know, how the government functioned, uh, you know, and then he, in volume three, he talks about, uh, you know, the Punic War between uh, Rome and Carthage. Volume four is about, uh, you know, other characters uh, such as the Gracchus brothers, uh, Drusus, and volume five is uh, essentially mostly about Julius Caesar, okay? Uh, so that's the general contents of the book. And in the next video, I want to talk about uh, some, you know, things that he got wrong about Rome, okay? Uh, there were some, I think, uh, mistakes in, you know, Momsen's views, and I want to address them in the next video.